Hello everyone, welcome to Source Filmmaker Tutorial. I am Foxy.Bunny and this is Pirate Gamers channel. So, as you've read by the title, today we're going to fix the issue of the lighting of certain models in certain maps. Some of which are too dark and some are too bright. I have two examples right here. Foxy's endoskeleton is too dark in FNAF 2 map and Ryoko, Ryoko's skin is too bright in like every map so we're gonna fix these issues by just adding some model materials like you can't really see her lips or even mouth or any details on her face so we're gonna change that today okay so I have my map D Inferno loaded here and we're gonna use this map for Ryoko as you can see here, Ryoko is too bright, she is literally shining. So, for the first step, right click on Ryoko's model and add override materials. Then go to the show in element viewer and select model. Here as you can see she has quite a lot of materials and you, you can't really see her mouth. Look at her face. Like really this is her mouth. We, we can't see it and we don't want that. So find the right materials. For example we're gonna start off with her face and we're gonna add attribute and our attribute will be color. Now you don't need to type in color. You'll need to type in dollar sign base texture and her skin will go full bright white then go to add attribute again color and this time go for the dollar sign color now as you can see it, go, it goes pitch black and it's <laughs> not re really a good sign but the thing is you can change that color to whatever you want You can turn her like she just puked. Or even make her a zombie or hawk. Okay, I mean, this is pretty decent. Then go to her skin and repeat the same process. Now, why is her chest like this? Why does her chest look like this? Is it because of the lighting? No? Okay, it's because of the model. It's a part of the model. Alright then, just right click and paste the previous color. Now as you can see, she's not shining anymore. And we can see her lips. But her lips are, you know, they are still bright. So yeah, basically you have to repeat the same process as you did for the skin and face for lips. Okay, now what I want to do here is paste the same color as her skin and maybe make it a little bit darker a little bit to red now you see it's fairly visible from a distance yeah i think this one this one works well yeah so we are basically done with real cool as you can see the details are really shown here they are visible clear as day and it's nice let's go to real foxy okay so and for the real foxy i've loaded FNAF 2 map because I wanted a large area without light reaching a wall. Now, for some reason, Ryoko's model break in this map. I don't know why, her skin just goes pitch black. Look at her. Now, as for Foxy, you, you see, you can't really see his hook or even hand, his endoskeleton in general. I mean, you can see it from some angles, but it's not gonna do you any good. So yeah, we're gonna go with the Foxy add overall materials. Go to the model. Then, you see here, this is the example that, that I was talking about Ryoko's. It goes bright white, as you can see here. But then after you do the color one, it goes pitch black. But you can't really see it on this model because it's already pitch black. You see? Perfectly balanced. 
Now we're gonna just make it a little bit lighter. Yeah, that's it. And as you can see, some of the parts are still remaining pitch dark. But you can fix them as well. Just find the right materials. As you can see, I found this material, and this is the right one, as I can see here. Now remember, if you if you delete the materials that you added, color-based texture, it will return to the original skin, but in order to do that, you'll have to restart SFM. You have to close the software and then reboot it again. Otherwise, it won't work. So yeah, we're gonna just copy and paste it here. Yeah, it looks fairly the same, but I wanna make it a little bit darker just to make it more colorful and beautiful. So yeah, this is basically how you can fix lighting on certain models in certain maps. Now I'm going to close down the SFM and open it back up because I want to show you an example for what ha what really happens if you only add in color. A few moments later. Okay, so for example, I have Nami here from Sarahat Pirates One Piece series. Uh, I'm going to change her hair, only her hair. So go to the same boring process as the last ones, but instead this time adding color. Just color, not base checks or anything, just color. As you can see, it straight up goes for pitch black. But the thing is, you can't really add in white. There's no white in these colors, so you can make it like pink, light green, light blue, or anything like that. It just doesn't work. It goes to, to the original color. It's pitch black. You can add in just any color, like it works with red. But pink, no, it it doesn't work. Now, I'll go, I'm gonna delete this and do this again, but this time with base texture, and you're gonna see the difference. So yeah, you see we already have the white color. Now that we have changed it, it goes for white and even gray. So yeah, you can change her like this. And remember, first you have to add in base texture and then the color. Otherwise, it won't work. As you might think a few moments later you see you see her face i hate so many control points on just a face on a model look at this it's such a mess let me just mess up with her before i finish this video <laughs> <laughs> i'm oozed up why does she look perfect <laughs> so that's it thank you everyone so much for watching remember i am foxy bunny this is pirate gamer channel if this tutorial helped Please make sure to leave a like, I really appreciate it and subscribe for even more tutorials and watch my videos, okay, bye.